Passing him right on screen is Kolohe and Dino. Coming off the bottom. Forehand wrap for Brother Andino. Little wrap again in the pocket. This wave is setting up a closeout section. Goes for the slob. Lays back in the whitewater. He wants to fight to earn the finish, and that wave's going to take him down. Lohe had an 8.0 on the wave before and had the lead. That'll be his backup score. Beautiful rhythm from Carves. Really shows a great example of a solid lower surfer doing the best on rail and above the lip. Yeah, you've got to have the full package out here, Joe. There's no faking it. You're on the wave long enough to expose any kind of weaknesses, any kind of repetitive repertoire. You, you know, the judges want to see that variety. Let's have a look, Chloe. Nice size wave here. Nice opening jam. I like the way he's taking his time. You can see he's not rushing. What that's doing is it's making his turns nice and clean. Beautiful transition there, just not forcing the issue. A little wrap around, waiting for it to set up. You can see him stomp on the tail. Now he widens his stance and goes for that big slob grab there. Just letting go maybe a little early. And hence an incomplete maneuver at the end of that one. Still going to be a good score for him. But it's going to improve his situation. His second high score, just the one at the moment. I love the way he's taking his time, relaxing into it. Chloe and Dino surfing nice and smooth. It's going to drop a nice st score here to back up that 8.0. He's going to have to pull those airs off. Let's have a look here if we can see. Grabs it, let's go, and just